All right, so I got my new parts in the mail the other day from Mona at sterlingkit.com. Here are the parts that I removed. So it came with came with this new pump and came with this little um, lever that kind of like uh, primes fuel. So you, you just pump this and it runs the, uh, you can see that working down there, runs the pump, came with the new injector. Um, of course, with the new injector, it needed a new head and uh, this new fuel line and kind of like the uh, overflow pipe. The old exhaust mounted to the side of the old head and now um, I still have room so I just run it out the bottom. On the website it shows like a 90 degree copper tubing but um, I just put it together like that. Um, I had to retighten all my fittings. Had a little bit of leaking going on in a few spots. You can see I've been running running it. I've been playing with it. But here's here's all the old stuff. Uh, the old pump. The old head. Of course, uh, the injectors in there. All it was doing was dripping. Wasn't really uh, atomizing the fuel. But Mona was real great about um, giving me all the upgrade pieces. So now, basically, it's just like the 2025 model. And so I'm going to pause this video here and you will see it run in just a second. All right, so I got it to run a little bit slower. Um, found a few things that might be an issue. Um, little, wait, that little rod right there kind of slid that away and it came off the uh, pump alright so it's running it's been out a lot of a uh, I got a few leaks that looks like coolant down there. So uh, I gotta tighten that up. Um, everything seems to be alright with it now. I, I did try to adjust to come off my table here. I did try to adjust the intake or the injector a little bit. And I'm not sure uh that knocking noise is uh, is normal, but um, it's it's running. Um, so I'll have to do a little research on that. And I think I'm losing parts. <laughs> yeah, stuff. So I just lost the nut off that piece. So I'm gonna shut it down, tighten everything up. Alrighty. Yeah, I lost the lost nut off of that right there. Uh, earlier when I was messing with the injector, um, I got it cranked up again and then, then that nut fell off. So now I gotta look around and it's brass, so uh, I might have a little bit of a tough time finding it without, uh, you know, I can't use my magnetic doohickey. Anyway, all right, it's running. And uh, that's it for now. Thank you.